Andrew McCart, IFL TV and association with MTK Global. I'm here in London for the press conference to announce Josh Kelly or David Avenisian versus Josh Kelly. Yes. With me I've got Josh Kelly himself. How are you feeling, sir? It's been all good Phoenix since I last saw you, so how are you feeling? Uh, good mate, good. I've had a nice little rest. Um, not too long, but long enough. And back in training now, but it's better to be home than uh, than away this time. Do you know what I mean? I like fighting at home. I love the, I love the home crowd. It's class. Obviously, this fight has been talked about for what best part of a year and a half, maybe. Uh, yeah, it's been going on and on. I mean, people. You've mentioned social media. People. It's just to give people a voice. Now, there's been some derogatory things said about you and your team and stuff like that. You're avoiding David. Blah, blah, blah. The fight is on. How excited are you to finally maybe shut these guys up on Twitter, yeah. or silence them a little bit, yeah. or just basically how are you excited to face David Avenition? Yeah, David's a great fighter, I respect him, um, I respect what he's done, um, I can't knock him for anything he's done, he's great, he's a good, he's a good solid fighter, um, but I was, ready, I was ready then, but I'm twice as ready now. Um, Obviously the illness and everything else, I'll go back into that and go dwell on the past. Um, as the past, we're moving forward and I don't want to taint this fight because I don't take the image of the fight because at the end of the day it's a great fight, I don't want to taint it with shit from the past, you get what I mean? Um, but mate, I feel, I, feel, uh, I feel like I'm ready, I feel like I want to take a load of fans from the, from the North East and Sunderland down. Um, they're going to come down on the bus loads. Um, so they're going to have like a, another another way days in a sense. Um, I can't wait, man. I can't wait to get, get the ball rolling, step in the ring and a uh, little cross and see him because that's going to be, that's gonna be um, probably the thing I need to, to really get me going for me. It's unfair. Some people might say that your last two performances have been sort of off par for yourself. Yeah. You, might have, you might admit that yourself, I don't know, but... Is it the case of the better the fighter you face, the better Josh, Cop Josh Kelly will see? Yeah, hundred percent. You got it. We're like, it's like a, it's like a football team when you play when you play another football team. You got you gonna you gonna perform, do you? It's like, in a sense, if I say to you now, and I say, I say, I say it, right. You're gonna run 400 meters, right? I want you to run it the fastest you can, right? You run one lap. The next time I go, you run 400 meters. But there's a million quid at the end. What are you gonna do? Yeah, I'm fuck, I'm gonna run it in this. You gotta run it. I'll do that in the world right. record. Time. You, you, you gotta, you gotta do it. You gotta do cut a couple of seconds off your last time. Exactly. You're gonna fly, ain't you? Do you know what I mean? So it's it's a fear factor. Like he's a he's a solid opponent. Um, I need to perform. Um, if I don't, I could get hurt. And that's it. I need to go back home, kiss my wife on the head, kiss my baby on the head, get. Get back home safe and sound, do you know what I mean? To the family with a win. And that's what I'm every time I'm in the gym. So you gotta think, you gotta think this sport's no joke. Um, you go in there and you're risking your life for the entertainment of people. So and the day I'm there, I'm ready, I'm training hard, I can't win. What means more to you? Silencing these people up that you avoided, David, or that European title? No, European title. European title? Yeah, European title. I'm not bothering me. You can talk what you want, it doesn't affect, it doesn't, it doesn't affect anything. Social media has been giving giving people these mouths, these these people for a platform to, to, to voice themselves. There's no social media, you wouldn't know Joe Bloggs is rating is your next best thing, or you wouldn't know Joe Bloggs is saying you're going to get knocked out. Do you know what I mean? You just have self belief, at the end of the day, none of them voices are going to help you in the ring. Only you, only you and your opponent in there. And that's when, that's when, that's when it gets down to it, and all the training you did, your ability, your, your talent, whatever you did, that's what's going to show up. And God willing, I, just, I, I perform the way I can perform, I know I can perform. What can the fans expect from you on, on March 28th at the O2? I mean, what does it mean to you, first of all, to headline at the O2? Uh, mad, absolutely mad. Um, getting bigger and bigger. Shouldn't be the stadium, stadium of light. Never that, know. Is that pressure on you, obviously, to perform and get this win on March 28th to get that stadium of light fight? Uh, nah. I Do think you feel I, pressure? Nah. Don't feel any pressure. I'm an underdog. Mm. How can you feel pressure when you're an underdog? Do you know what I mean? You got, you you've got like uh, internal pressure in yourself, thinking I know how good I am, so I know what I can do, and if I can do that, I can win. And so you got the internal pressure of thinking I need to perform, but pressure from outside, I don't really feel much because we all go back home, we all live our little lives, we all live out dinner and go to bed. Do you know what I mean? And I'm not thinking about you while you're dinner and go to bed. I'm just thinking about myself and the way I'm working and my family and what I'm doing. As long as I'm healthy sharp and um, can perform at, um, and whatever happens is meant to happen. I want to ask as well, what did you make of Neil Marsh's sort of pitch, shall we say, yeah, at the press conference there? 
it was funny, it was the schoolboy stuff in it. Like, it, it's, I mean, this fight's a great fight. I don't want to taint it with the past stuff, do you know what I mean? Um, some of the stuff he, can, he, 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 he believes is true, some of the stuff he, I know for a fact is not true. But at the end of the day, I'm not, I'm not going to be the person with the biggest mouth in the room. I'm going to be the guy sitting there quiet. And them are the guys you got to worry about. I'm, David keeps yourself quiet and keeps yourself to yourself. That's what you got to be worried about. That's a fight that you need to be worried about. You don't need to be worried about the guys who's totally allowed us. You don't need to, um, that's why it doesn't affect us. And, I mean, I, I, outside the ring, I, I guess they're all uh, good guys. I respect David. I think he's a, he's a great fighter, but I take comfort in what they're seeing because they, they might be underestimating what they're going to get. Is this one of those fights as well? What final question before I let you go, Josh? Yeah. Is this one of them fights you just want to get this win and just put it to bed and just move on? Has this been haunting you for like the year and a half this fight? Has it been in the nah, back of your mind? No. Nah, nah. I've been looking forward to it. I've been looking forward to the day it gets, gets signed, the day it gets announced. I've been looking forward to it. Because I know what I've been working on in the gym. And um, I know the past couple of fights have not have not great, so that, that, try, that gives me even more confidence. Cause it's it's now shedding light on me. Like this guy's not this guy's not just, just Kelly's nobody. You're gonna walk through him. He'd be there for six rounds. You walk through him. The rest of him. You know what I mean? And you you you, you punch too hard. You're too fit. You're too this. You're too that. Let's see. I'm I'm ready. To, I'm risking everything. So let's see. Well, Josh, as always, it's a pleasure to talk to you. But thank you, Inspector TV champion. Thank you, Thank you.